Hello, Revealer Souls. Welcome to a new Malo channel. If you are new to our channel, please do subscribe and follow us for more videos like this. To Laos, I dreamed I stood upon a little hill and at my feet there lay ground that seemed like a waste garden flowering at it filled with buds and blossoms. There were pools that dreamed black and unruffled. There were white lilies, a few, and crocus, and violet, purple or pale, snake-like fertilities, scarves seen for the and grass, and true green ears. Blue eyes of the sky, penny edge winked in the sun, and there were curious flowers before unknown, in flowers that were stained with moonlight or with shades of natural's willful moods and here a one that had drunk as the stands a story turn on brief moment in a sunset blades of grass that in an hundred springs had been slowly but excusedly nurtured by the shears and watered with the scented dew long covered in lilies therefore rays of the sun had been only God's glory, for never a sunrise must, the luminous air of heaven, beyond abrupt, a grey stone wall, oh, air grown with velvet moss. Uprose, and gazing, I stood long, mauled mast, to see a place so strange, so sweet, so fair, and as I stood and marveled, lo, across the garden came a youth, one hand he raised, to shield him from the sun, his wine tossed hair was twinned with flowers, and in his hand he bore a purple bunch of bursting grapes. His eyes were clear as crystal, not all was he, white as the snow or pathless mountains floor, red were his lips as red wine split the dyes. A marble floor, his brow tells Danny, and he came near me with his lips uncurled and kind, and caught my hand and kissed my mouth and gave me grabs to eat and said, Sweet friend, come, I will show thee the shadows of the world and images of life. See, from the south comes the pale pigment that had never an end, and lo, within the garden of my dream, I saw two walking on a shining plain. Of golden light, the one did joyous seem, and fair and blooming, and a sweet refrain came from his lips. He sang of pretty maids, and joyous love of comely girl and boy. His eyes were bright, and mid the dancing blades of golden grass his feet did trip for joy, and in his hand he held an ivory lute with strings of gold that were as maiden's hair, and sang with voice as tuneful as a flute, and round his neck three chains of roses were. But he that was his comrade walked aside, he was full sad and sweet, and his low joys were strange with wondrous brightness, staring wild with gazing, and he sighed with many sighs that moved me, and his cheeks were wan and white. Like pallid lilies, and his lips were red like puppies, and his hands he clenched or tight, and yet again unclenched, and his head was wreathed with moon flash pale as lips of death. A purple robe he wore, or wrought in gold with the device of a great snake whose breath was fiery flame, which when I did behold I fell every weeping, and I cried, Sweet youth, tell me why, sad and sighing, those dust row, these pleasant realms, I pray thee speak me smooth. What is the thy name? He said, My name is Loud. Then Stride the first did turn himself to me and cried, He lied, for his name was Sham. But I am Love, and I was wont to be alone thus fair garden till he came. And as 
By night, I'm true love. I fulfill the hearts of boy and girl with mutual flame. Then sighing said the other, How will I'm the love that dare not speak its name. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe.